so now in this question is asking identify the compound x in the following sequence of the reactions toluene is reacting with chlorine in the presence of light is giving us x and x on hydrolysis at 373 kelvin gives us benzaldehyde now this reaction is from ncert the chapter is aldehyde ketones and carboxylic acid and we all know that the answer is the second one out of these four options so the answer is option number two right let's move on to the next question so now one more question now this is a question from the chapter structure of atom in which an element lutetium is given that is having the atomic number 71 and the mass number 175 and we have to find out the number of protons neutrons and electrons right so let's move on to the solution now atomic number is the number of protons so the number of protons is equal to 71 right and if you talk about number of electrons number of electrons will be equal to the number of protons that's why it will be also equal to 71 and the number of neutrons we can find the number of neutrons by mass number minus atomic number so mass number is 175 and atomic number is 71 so 175 minus 71 will be 104 now this is number of neutrons so what is asking is protons neutrons and electrons so protons and electrons are equal that is 71 and 71 and the number of neutrons is 104 that's why our correct answer is option number four right let's move on to the next question so now this is a question from the chapter dnf block elements in this he is asking identify the incorrect statement some statements are given to us and we have to find out the incorrect statement first statement is the transition metals and their compounds are known for their catalytic activities due to the ability to adopt multiple oxidation state to form complexes so there are two reasons for that the metals can act as catalyst first they provide the surface second they have variable oxidation state so this first one is absolutely correct this is the correct statement second one the interstitial compounds are formed by the atoms which occupy the interstitial sites and those atoms are hydrogen carbon nitrogen etc so this is also correct and the third one the oxidation state of chromium in chromate ion and dichromate ion now in the chromate ion the oxidation state is plus six and dichromate ion the oxidation state again it is plus six and he is saying it's not the same it means that this statement is incorrect and this will be our answer so our answer is option number three right let's move on to the next question